Welcome back, Edmund. One second. Oh. <laughs> I have to. I have to make sure people don't message me uh, while this is going, so we don't hear that. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Oh. Uh, How do you do? Press. Uh, do not disturb. Okay. Yes, that works. I also have set it to automatically not do that, but you shouldn't have to worry about that, considering we won't hear your sound. Anyways, I. I just started do I sound, recording. Do I sound okay? <laughs> Yeah, you sound fine. Hello! Yeah, Edmund, late start. <laughs> uh, so, Paul had a whole lot of footage recorded for this, for today, but then I, I, I clumsily deleted it like a baboon, so, so now we're gonna Was watch... Not good enough? So now we're gonna watch me play live. Oh yeah, it's just, I didn't have enough space. I deleted a lot of stuff that I shouldn't have, apparently. Uh, so anyways, you get to, to see live footage now, Edmund, so just like you wanted, you can have me fail or succeed. Are you gonna uh, be able to, are you, you're doing this like a real streamer then, you're gonna have to talk and play at the same time? Yeah, that's right, I, I do that every, every once in a while, but it's not live for, for the people, it's just live for you and Paul. <laughs> I do sure. Eden runs. Oh yeah, you do Eden runs. Got a whole lot of yeah, I like, Eden streak going I, on. <laughs> I like to try and challenge my luck against the game. What's the record Eden streak at this point? Do, does anybody know? <laughs> well, from, from like, Paul or from everyone? In general. Mine's mm. like 19 or something. I always you know, get screwed over around 20. <laughs> Damn it. What's, what's the world's record? What well, indeed. Like, I think it's like 100 or something. Who knows? Mm. A couple hundred. Yeah, there's some people at insane records. I, wish I think, I think in um in the expansion that's coming out, I think you might get an achievement for some for different streaks, but it's a bit hardcore and not, not that many people like doing it. Oh wow. So, so basically get achievement for general streaks and regardless of character. Oh I have a character specific one. I think it's just general. Ah. Oh yes, so it would probably be far too. If people easy. like it, we can always just throw in more oh, random this. shit as it goes to make it harder and harder for people to 100% the game. <laughs> oh yeah, can't have too much of that. Hmm. Yeah, that's why you're adding achievements like do stuff as a lost. Just imagine an achievement to get a five streak as a lost. Ooh, more, <laughs> more stuff. I would, cool. I want to. I want to know the record for a lost streak. And that's what it's I like want. 20 as well. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's Jeez. insane. Yeah, just one dude just playing as a loft a lot. I think he's like a French guy too. <laughs> Great. I wonder <laughs> if there's any way to verify his his streak credibility. Well, he was recording. I think he was streaming them on Twitch. I think. Well, was he doing the entire twenty in one go? <laughs> I don't know. He just, I think he just did it on and off. Amazing. Like he does it. Always, always records his. Um, streaks on one on Twitch and then takes breaks, you know, mm, where you get to sense. relax. You know, not that many people realize that you can, uh, the mulligans don't damage you. Yeah, I bet. Well, unless they explode. You could, just, you could just go and, you could just go and just touch them with the, with the meat. Oh yeah, I should probably do that. Oh, no, the meat is not as strong as it is in this game than it was in Reaper. I might have it's made, in might have made it slightly strong in the uh, Eternal Edition, I'm not sure. Oh god, well, ah, good I Do you know what the chances of, what, in, in the Eternal Edition, what's, uh, what's, what are the chances of champions? What, do you know what the percentages are? You mean Eternal Champions or regular champions? Both. Uh, I think I left the regular ones basically alone, but I, the Eternal ones, they've got a whole, a whole system where, where they, where you have an Eternal count and a, the eternal counter goes down with every eternal that spawns, and if you don't get eternals, it'll go up over time, and then you could end yeah. up having multiple in one room. And he you makes a you whole hope. deal for it. Yeah, it's all yep. very well balanced. Yep. And because of that, it makes <laughs> you hope that you get eternals before you get boss. Well, because depends. a boss might be eternal because of it. But the, but the bosses can give you yeah. eternal hearts if, if you're lucky, if they're eternal, so that's great. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I really hope, like, hopefully people will try to do do a full mod for Eternal Mode, and then we can add Ooh. it in officially. There you go. Yes. Because, like, the, 
the plan, I mean, I hope so, I hope anyway, is to make it so, like, when people do mods, so if you, if you do eternal bosses, eternal boss mods, it shouldn't be that hard to do, because it's essentially what you did, um, it should be pretty, fairly easy to do. Well, with and the then, source uh, code, I'm not sure how much of, a, how much power people will have with just the game. You know, you can basically do, like, everything that you did with Monstro here, you could do it with the, with the mod tools. That's pretty easy. You like, like you could you like how he splits. I do. I, I love how he. Low. I didn't know he split again. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> yep, isn't he and again. Does he split another time when he's tiny? Oh yeah, tiny. Yep. Oh, this is it. The other Maybe one's gonna still. split one more time. The big one. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty, pretty great. That would be awesome to have all these uh, eternal bosses in, because then we could officially add them in to a, a whole mode. Oh man, that would be so great. I the plan is like whenever somebody makes if somebody makes something really awesome or they make like a, a mod to a boss or just a whole full boss or a new item or whatever else if it's really awesome um, we're gonna just like add it to the game officially or even add it as an unlock like add like a new Ooh, a new yeah, mode you get that, that should be official. Hopefully it'll keep things going for a long time let people make make tons of cool stuff and then if it's really good we'll just pop it in. Not bad. That would be it very be nice. Official. People could totally be rewarded for making mods. Wow. Is That's... it going to be like an achievement to uh, to make a, to download <laughs> use a mod or something? No, we don't have any achievements for mod stuff yet. <laughs> not like Doom has like an achievement. Another to... thing is possible because you know not everybody wants to. Look how big that belt is. Look how giant that graphic was. Oh yeah. Yeah. Gotta love all those. Well, I suppose it's it's your mom's spell, so it'll, it will be big, right? Yeah, but how come the sprite is far too large to even fit within the line? The lines are all supposed to be the same thickness. <laughs> yep. Thickness. Well, I'm and sure. Did, and why did the belt shrink when he put it on? Oh, why indeed? It's it's one of those magical items, just <laughs> like the one ring from Lord of the Rings. Oh, gluttony! That's that could be beneficial. No eternal you do, um, where I leave creep. Did you do eternal uh uh sins? I sure did. I yeah. did I did all like, fourteen or no even more. I don't know sixteen? Yeah, I did all sixteen of them I guess. Jeez. Because yeah. Eternal Gluttony leaves creep behind the brimstone lasers he makes. Yeah. There's eternal ultra gluttony as well and such. So, yeah. yeah. And eternal then... envy puts himself together if he makes contact with each other. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but it doesn't. Yeah, I, it it sucks that more people aren't experiencing this. But I mean, I guess there's a shitload of people that still own. Hey, by the way, you want to put uh in the in the next sale that goes up, what what percentage off do you want, Isaac? So you want shit everybody to own it? Should we put it on sale for super cheap? Oh yeah, let's put it up for ninety nine percent off. Oh yes. Yeah. Do you really want that? I'm not sure. Nah, it's probably <laughs> it's probably best if we just leave it at the the usual ninety percent off, so we can still make a little money. Yeah. You don't want to make one. Uh, not point not one euro. Oh yes. It's one cent. That's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Is this split into little ones. No, nope, that one follows you, but he's incapable of doing so because he's locked in, so he just stands in place. <laughs> I'll do what Valve do to some of their games, like when we made Left 4 Dead 2 for free over the weekend one, one time. Oh yeah, you could buy it and it was forever yours. Yep, do that. <laughs> Certainly not. <laughs> <laughs> we could do it on the 10 year anniversary where, uh, you know, nobody cares. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. I, I killed it at the perfect spot, and I also unlocked the secret room. I, amazing. Uh, a nickel. What a cute little game it is. <laughs> uh, ah, shit. But, like not many people, not many people realize that the whole point of uh, mulligans in the first chapter were to have an enemy that had a higher probability of blowing open a secret so they would know that the secret exists. Ah, not even I know that was the point. <laughs> that was the point. That was the whole point. <laughs> oh, it was all intelligent design all along. Uh, yep. God confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> Elaborate. Indeed.
Oh well, I probably shouldn't Are you gonna do risk this. It? I'm probably gonna die already, so I really shouldn't have. But then again, I could buy something. Oh man, this room's running fairly smooth currently. Hmm. I, it's very weird with the spiking performances. <laughs> That's flash for you. Uh, well, pff, mostly action script too as well. But then again, all all types of vector graphics are obviously gonna be a problem because. Scaling them up to to a certain amount of pixels is gonna be definitely problematic. Oh well. What did you do over the weekend, Florian? What was that? What do you What do you do What do you do in your spare time when you're not? I want to know a day. I want to know a day in the life of Florian. Oh yes, I was I was just thinking, should I be doing? Should I prepare a daily Florianism for you? But then I yeah, I, I, I forgot. I I did you not. Forgot. I no, I did. I suppose I tried and I procrastinated. It was not successful. I couldn't come up with anything good. So, so how about the users can can pick whatever I say today. The one best thing I say in this video. I, I make that the the daily Florianism. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I, I have an idea of how I can get a Florianism. I'm gonna. I got an idea. One second. Let me just go to. <laughs> my website real quick here. Did you ever do any of my polls? Oh yeah, I, I sure did. Uh, I, would, I, you, would you like to talk about some of the answers that... <laughs> uh, I'll, find, I'll find a good one and you can... Uh, oh no, I have no we keys. Can, uh, we can argue hey, all about it. Remember when Super beginning. Troll Bombs went through objects? Oh yes, they sure did. Well, there was that one about the where you masturbate, and I, I said on the computer, and then I, I commented on it, sticky keyboard 24-7, and then <laughs> you automatically retweeted it, apparently, so everyone <laughs> now knows my shame. <laughs> yeah, that put his dicky keys on, damn it. Which isn't even true, because... Here, here, here's a question that, that wasn't even on, on a poll. Oh what's, your what's your record, Florian? How many times in a day? Oh, well, that's... I don't really count every day, but I'm sure I've done 10 in one day. Very nice. Are you masturbating okay. in celebration? Yeah, right. that, was, that was the sound of it. <laughs> so it sounds like... Yep. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! The statistics make me rock hard! I, I, I remember when I was, uh, I think I was 12, um, it was around the time I discovered it. My record was 13 times in a day. Oh wow! You, you've, yeah. You've beat my After that, I didn't, very I, good. Didn't try to, I didn't try to beat the record. I mean, I suppose if I would try to beat the record, could I go for 20? Who knows? I mean, it's not like oh, it well. hurts. Yeah. After a while, you're gonna be injured. Really? There was that Asian guy that holds the record in longest masturbation se session, where he just whacked it for like multiple days on end. So if you can't do that, then how hard could it be to do 20 short individual ones? Oh god, I'm so gonna die. I, what have <laughs> I done? This is it. I'm, I'm not even showing off a whole lot of eternal stuff. All I got is this eternal girdy, and I'm gonna you die to it. Oh fuck. Oh yeah, I didn't have a key. That was right. Oh, come we on, flies. Flies, you're fucking this up. Well, I guess I'll, guess I'll go to the item room when I die. Ah! What a horrible night to have a curse. Or is it? Oh it god, now. oh god! Dead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, please no! You could totally do it now! Oh yeah, with totally one heart. No problem. How come Maybe you work for item... Babylon when you have one heart? Huh? Don't you have the oh. horror of Babylon, how come it's not active? Oh. You need to be at half a heart. Yeah, that's the same thing in Rebirth, actually. I thought it yeah, was except... when you are at one. Oh wow, boy! Look at that. This, this will help. This could help oh, indeed. Never mind. I know. What I'm, I know what I'm thinking about now. Yeah, it's only in, when you are Eve. That's the only time you have it, which is actually kind of weird because any other time you get that item, it's gonna be shit. But if you're Eve, then then you're slightly better with that item. Why the hell is that? Why indeed? Oh. Actually, I'm thinking she is Edmund. Oh fuck! I already. Okay, this is it. I'm sure. <laughs> Just go hide. Hide behind the rock. Hide on a rock. Oh, I'm Stay so sorry. I'm so smart, I could have done that all along. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I buy a pig and she is a herb That's all you need to do. Oh, me what? <laughs> oh no, it's, it's gonna come for me. It's gonna spawn flies and they're gonna come for me. 
Can I shoot? Oh, right, the body's gonna take care. No? Ah, flies! <laughs> the flies! Oh, yes, that's right, we, we use skill. Still yes. Me fapping in celebration. More celebratory fapping, yes. Or <laughs> uh, how do you wipe your ass? Oh, boy. I'm, What's your I'm, technique? I'm sure that's very boring the way I wipe my ass. It's just regular. regular wiping. Yeah, you yeah, stand that's up. The thing is, there is no regular wiping. Everybody is, wipes their ass differently. Oh, yeah. I see. Like, I've heard that people wipe their ass while sitting down, and I've heard people wiping their ass when standing up. <laughs> and I am Not. the latter. Yeah, the most common is standing up, but not by a lot. Well, that's weird. I definitely sit down, I guess. Yeah, me too. <laughs> but do you wipe with you? Do you reach between your legs? Do you lean up to one side and wipe? Or do you lean forward and wipe down the back? Oh god, I I don't even know for sure. <laughs> I probably, probably do most of us. Visualize yourself going to the bathroom and think, where does my hand go? It's automatic when you know it. <laughs> Never thought about that. I guess I must be doing the sideways bend. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's the only yeah, that thing that makes sense because otherwise my huge penis would be in the way. Exactly. <laughs> huge dong. Uh. Wing. <laughs> yep, poor me. That was, the, that was the question that started the whole polls because it, it was a, an argument that I was having with a few of my friends and they were all talking about wiping and then so I said something about the way I wipe and they're like, you wipe that way? And I'm like, wait, how there's do you wipe? Different, what different ways? There's different ways? Oh my god. And uh, there are a lot of different ways and, oh. and it's very odd how much of a range there actually is. And oh, uh, that was like, hey, I wonder how many of these questions there are. <laughs> so many. Made you uh, think. There are not that many that are that. That was the best one, and, that, and I was, that was the one I was happiest with, too, because the answers were so close. Um, <laughs> not bad. But, uh, hey, Florian. Do yeah. you believe God exists? Hmm. Uh, I, I'm sorry, but this is also going to be boring. It's just a big old maybe, because I think that... It's ridiculous to have religion because it's either probably wrong or it. Oh wait, no, it's either it's either wrong or it's probably blasphemy because 99% you 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 got ro word God's word 100% wrong, right? If 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 there is in fact a, re a God. <laughs> no key. So I gotta go with agnostic then. Ah, oh, no key again. Fuck. Uh, Maybe it's yeah. empty room up there. I'm pretty much in the same boat. I mean, even though I'm leaning, I, I lean towards atheism, but I, I have a, a regret. It's like, where's the fun? Oh, I, where's I the fun in, in just completely cutting the possibility out of my brain? But then my brain goes, but come on. <laughs> yes, I. We all gotta have hope that there's such a god. <laughs> yeah, it's the same thing. It's like I really also I don't want to cut out the idea that maybe there's Bigfoot, you know. <laughs> I kind of want there to be Bigfoot. Oh man, all this for yeah. nothing. <laughs> or like a Loch Ness monster situation, or aliens. Like I want all that stuff to happen. You know, I want. I'd like the possibility of at some point in my t in my life having something that defies basic logic to mm. come into play. So I don't want to throw it out the window completely. Not like what I believe would actually make any difference. Jesus. Indeed. I wish what was that? I wish dragons existed. Oh yeah, Paul's got this. At some point, Paul's this weird you know, dragon Christian fetish. Scientists believe, <laughs> believe that uh, dragons are proof. The legend of the dragon is proof that uh, dinosaurs existed at the same time as man. <laughs> yep. That's what they, what they believe the dragon legend spawned from. And that's why it's there. Proof. Yes, the proof is right in the books. <laughs> Google it. <laughs> Uh, I guess that makes sense, hmm. But then again... You might... I just thought something. Yes? What if the internet was a fictional place? What is it? Is it is a fictional place. Damn it, Paul! <laughs> 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 it's all made up, yeah. Paul! I'm not the real! It's real! We're all, we're all fake, Paul! You're, you've gone insane! <laughs> it's just a big man of all our imaginations. Uh, hey, Florian, how often do you bathe? Well, 
I used to only do it, I only used to only shower once a week, but now I have to do it more often because my hair would get too greasy now that it's long. <laughs> Your hair's pretty long now, right? Yeah, it's really long. I haven't cut it in three years. I mean, I, I cut it, I cut off the front bit that, that hangs in my eye, but that's it. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that. What is up with that? You got like a Prince Valiant thing going on there. <laughs> you're cutting your hair yourself and you're cutting bangs. I cut what? They're called bangs. Bangs? That's what you're doing to your hair. Yeah, bangs. It's, it's when you take the hair that's long in the front and then you cut it short so it's not in your face. Oh, that's what Banks is. I thought Banks was... Uh, let's see. Yeah, I guess if, if it's on the sides, yeah, but... I, I cut it unsymmetrical, so I don't think that counts as Banks. <laughs> yeah, it does, because people have Bangs that are asymmetrical. <laughs> well, that's great, then, I guess. Have, I've, have I've got a really name. Long? Like, are you only cutting one side of your Bangs? Yeah, I guess, because the other side goes well, but the, the rest of the hair just flows into the rest of the hair. <laughs> so, like, so a mental picture for everybody listening. So your hair is, let's let's say your hair is even length, very long black hair all around, right? But then you just take one half of your bangs in front of your head, the long hair, and you just cut it short. <laughs> yep. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> Emos. <laughs> it's not like anything, it's completely Florian. Like, that is a... <laughs> Yeah, that's right, and everyone will be guilty of cultural appropriation, yeah? Exactly. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna die. No, don't die. Shit! Flies! <laughs> Haunted by eternal flies. Oh god, no, the creep! Oh, the, the curse, wow. <laughs> oh my god, no, 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 no! <laughs> Wait, do I have... Oh, that's Guppy there. I thought that was some kind of demon baby for a second. Oh god, I hope I'm not being a horrible host and not entertaining at all while being so distracted with the game. No, so far, I think you've been pretty entertaining. Oh, very good. Are uh, you a bit quiet, by the way, Edmund? I'm watching. <laughs> no, no, I mean, your actual volume has decreased. I think the last time uh, we did this, I wasn't watching. I was just talking. Oh, no! Yeah, no uh, Ow. Uh, you know, but but you you're really getting hard to to hear because you're so. Oh, you mean quiet like like on the microphone? I'm yes, uh, as I just said, your volume has decreased. <laughs> How's this? Is this better, Florian? Actually, no. Damn it. Oh. Uh, sounds really loud to me. Oh really? Am I? Did I? Is there something wrong with my ears? Am I? Am I losing? It's ears. Ah, oh, you're doing it on purpose now, Edmund. Am I loud now? No, you're quiet still. Um, I'm not doing it purposefully. Did I? Did He's I? Loud to me, oh, did I decrease my volume on Skype? Is that, let me see. Did I press this button? No, this, this is. This is the best part. This is the best part of the whole thing. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so, well, I'm professional, Squid. Where I will surely die, and Edmund will laugh at me. What do you mean? Like people know who you are at this point. You have an established name. Yes. But you went with um, Game Squid. Oh, that's right. Yeah, because I had this this friend that I made this channel with, who is now not doing it anymore. So that's oh, great. No. At least you should, you should, it should be called Florian Hemsel's Game Squid. <laughs> yes, that's right. Maybe I should change it. What do you think, audience? Hmm. <laughs> oh yes, always drawing the squids. That, you got that tablet and you were like drawing a squid. Oh yeah. <laughs> you should draw the stuff. I should draw the stuff. But I I gave the tablet to mom because I I thought I wouldn't need it anymore because because I was talked into buying a, a, an HTC Vive and that was a really bad investment and I'm not using yeah, it why to the hell did you do that? Why indeed? Peer pressure, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> 
that's, that's so you could be alone. And, I, I feel like a, a lot of like virtual reality stuff is way more entertaining for other people watching the people <gasps> playing with the headset on. Oh my less. god! Wow, that was so close again. I'm so terrible, just so terrible. But there you go. We saw a, a duke of flies that that basically did nothing but spawn lots of flies, and I should yeah. have taken those hearts. And when he did, they were really hard to kill, and that was it. His his death is his worst revenge. <laughs> Here, I'll go. I'll go for more uh, more questions. Have you ever put anything up your butt for sexual gratification? Uh, well, not for sexual gratification, but when I was really young, I put my fingers up my butt when I was having a, a bath, and it was interesting, I guess. <laughs> interesting. I, I felt the poop that was in there, and then I, I thought that was the best way to ever clean your butt. <laughs> <laughs> I have vivid memories of exactly the same thing when I was little. <laughs> interesting. It was so clean because it was just in water, so nothing could go wrong. <laughs> I remember the bathtub too. Um, around that same time. <laughs> we're thinking like, wait, can I just poop right now? Because it's kind of like a toilet. <laughs> like, wait, the bathroom. <laughs> and my mom got very mad. What does the, <laughs> the eternal version of this boss do? Yeah, he, he reconnects. Oh, yep. that's what you're talking about. Okay. Yep, like, that's the one. small pieces touch each other, they become one again. If they're the Great. same size, and then it... They don't do it infinitely, I guess, and they get weaker every time, so it's not unfair, but it really can be quite frustrating when, when you originally enter, because you'll probably be dealing with it quite a, a while before I say at the very <laughs> least, it goes Lord, away. To, if you're not going to program the mods for this mode, then we could probably find somebody out there who's willing to do it, and you could direct it. I wish, I really wish. That, was, that would be my greatest... Greatest plan, really, if I could have someone who could do all these mods for me, and then I would just supervise them, and then I could I tell them. <laughs> oh, you, you wouldn't be programming, or would you? It oh, depends on how easy, easy the modding tools are for Afterbirth Plus. They say they say it's pretty easy. That's why I was like, I know it'll take a lot of time for Florian to do, and he's working on his other stuff, but like, I don't think it'd be that hard. But, you know. Well, yeah, well, that's not a good thing, you see, because. If it's not hard, then it probably doesn't have as many features as I would like. I feel like for the most part you'd be able to do what you want. Hmm. But uh, yeah, we'll, we'll cross that bridge and get to it. Sadly, I don't. I have zero interest in programming, so it's not something that I ask him about at all. <laughs> exactly, so yeah. <laughs> I wonder what modding tools. How easy are the modding tools for Afterbirth Plus? Well, that's what we're talking about. Like, when I looked. When, when, when we said for. A new Doom map, snap map's gonna be easy. I looked in and got, I thought, oh god, I, this isn't easy at all. <laughs> <laughs> Compared to how things were before, I mean, back in the day when you when you wanted like my first video game experience ever um, was was modding, trying to mod uh, uh, Doom maps and make make levels in Doom. Um, yeah. That was that was incredibly difficult, and they made it a little bit easier when Duke Nukem 3D came out. Um, and is, uh, is that actually but, made in Doom? What's that? Is that actually made in Doom? No. Oh, right. No, Duke, 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 Duke Nukem is a different uh, engine. Yeah, totally, totally different engine. Right. Well, Duke, Duke Nukem, unlike Doom, can you can put rooms above other rooms. Oh, is this a wise choice? Because if I take it, I'll be slow for sure, even if I... Ah, God. Ah, whatever, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> oh no, what happened to your belt? <laughs> <laughs> I've ripped my belt. I am the Incredible Hulk. Oh, oh, a heart, cool. I know that when I used Doom Builder, it was easier to understand than Ooh. Doom 2016 thing. Yeah. So map. I, I, I enjoyed that. I have memories of, of the Duke 3D stuff. I remember trying to, like, it was very difficult to stack rooms on rooms. It was Is so it, weird. It was I don't so think it's supposed too. to be pos possible to stack rooms on two rooms. I think everything has to be flat on from above. Oh wait, I'm gonna go to that curse room for sure. Let's see what's in there. <laughs> I mean, use the Emperor to get out so you can sp don't it take another half hit. Indeed. Now, ideally, I wouldn't have taken that blue heart, but whatever. Oh, there we go. Well, 
Worse indeed. Aha! And a white heart. Great, now I'm healthy again. Ah, go away, mouse. <laughs> uh. Will you become eternal? Well, looks like it, but this is pre-recorded, so I'll never know. <laughs> oh yes, the the room, the suicide room. Yes, perfect. <laughs> hey, Florian. Yes. Hey, Florian. <laughs> I, got a, I got a question for you. Hey, Edmund. Are ghosts yeah. real? Uh, nope. No. Not not even nah. close. No. What about what about you, Paul? Ghosts? <laughs> nah. Uh, nope. Paul, Paul believes in ghost type Pokemon. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> what about what about psychics? Psychics. I think it's just a massive coincidence that we end up getting stuff from where you wanted to. <laughs> just a massive coincidence. Oh yeah, I, I believe pretty much everything is a scam that is just the slightest bit supernatural. I think zodiacs are, are the biggest bullshit ever. Because how fucking much relevance can it possibly have how, what what time of year you, you've been born in for, for your personality? Theoretically, I mean, I'll play devil's advocate here, even though I, I'm on the same page as you. But um, theoretically, there would be more reason for Zodiac stuff to have some impact on who you are outside of religious stuff or really anything else. Because... It's the it's the positioning of the Earth between different planets that cause slight changes in gravity and pull. So you could say that children that children that are born are conceived in certain times, probably more conception and like when the brain is developing and stuff like that. Like the different pressures, the really subtle pressure um, that that happens through development uh, at different parts of the year um, could and in temperature. Um, you know, like different seasons, that could actually have some effect, but probably not. Yeah, probably not style. indeed. I think the only thing that we can assume is that people who are cancer do not believe in zodiacs, right? <laughs> are you cancer? <laughs> no, but I'm. I'm assuming that if something calls me cancer, I wouldn't believe it. <laughs> uh. What's your supposed zodiac sign? I'm Pisces. And I do fit the Pisces bill, like the description of Pisces works pretty well for me. I'm Libra, but my sister's I fit also like Pisces well. and she's the opposite of me, so it doesn't work at all. Damn it, are you twins? We are twins. Like, when was your birthday? Mine's March 2nd. Hmm. Mine was only the 10th of October. Only. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> oh Two yeah, right. Ago. That did happen just <laughs> recently, oh yeah. <laughs> That uh, makes you wait. Is that that's not um, Scorpio, is it? Uh, I'm Libra. It. Libra. Oh, I should know that because my daughter's Libra. Uh, well, Same. well, the, the, technically like it would be better to not know because it's probably bullshit. But yeah, I'm, I'm Gemini. But it's cool just though. In case. It still gives you like a, it, it gives you like a clan to claim. Oh yes, a clan. <laughs> it's part, part of a little. Oh little God. Please don't steal my 99 bombs, Mr. Greedhead of Eternity. Oh. I like balance. Oh yes, he specifically liked the Libra item in Isaac. <laughs> I like, but I like Everybody being the jack of all trades. Oh wow! What a description of you. I see. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh. Florian, how do you think people would rate your looks? I think they they're quite decent. Probably about six out of ten. I think you're higher. Do you? Hmm. Well, maybe. I I think I look good in pictures, but then when you meet me in person, I'm all, well, just Monster. bad bad posture and, and rude. So it's probably not, <laughs> <laughs> not, not the best. When they meet you in real life, they they're like, wait a minute, did he just cut part of his long hair off so he could see through it through his hair? <laughs> Wait, wow. wait, did you just call me a cunt? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, no, 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 not like this. Oh, the eternal one of this is pretty annoying. I it's know, what eternal mask do? Oh yeah, you'll see. Ah, it yeah. teleported. Is he teleporting? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my it god, it's... It's... Its heart, and it also deflects bullets too. Yeah, and it aims for me. Kind of more than usual. Come on. Pretty great. No! 
Oh, I missed. Wow. <gasps> yeah, seriously, no. Florian, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta figure out how to get this going here. This I, 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 I know it. It really has to happen. Just come on, guys. Anyone? Well, actually, no. We gotta wait because one. Once Afterburst Plus is out, then we'll see how how easy modding is, and then we'll see about the Eternal Rebirth. Ah! Oh my God! No! Jesus. No! No! We no! flaked. Like Fuck! No, no, that, that one's right in front of the boss, and I think they they stay Eternal too, right? Yeah. No! Amazing. Have to get good somehow. I'll never be good. Oh, this is actually. Keep dropping bombs. I know this bomb will now be perfectly placed. Oh, but that one—that's not the eternal. Oh, actually, it did hurt the eternal one. Keep throwing bombs. <laughs> well, there you go. Bombs. That's the one thing that I, whenever I watch Danielle stream, the one thing she does more than everybody else is she's dropping bombs and pushing them constantly. Oh, I, I gotta, I love doing that. It's, I think that's my favorite mechanic of the game, just using yeah. bombs as much as everyone's, possible. Everyone's dropping bombs except me. Yeah, you. It's annoying when you never drop those bombs, Paul. I might, I oh. might be the only one who relies my firepower on my actual shoot tears. Oh my god, I did it you and did I it. actually got a heart. Hooray! And then the boss will be eternal, like, Mask of Infamy or something. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> ah! Oh. Fuck these rooms! Wait, is there- oh yeah, there's a shop to get. Why are you going back? The shop. I have so much money, I must- I must shop. Oh boy. This is the easy room. It is actually fairly easy. What's Until the difference I... of, uh, what's, what's the uh, eternal of, uh, the this guy? Well, you can see it leaves creep where it shoots. Oh my god, I'm just too good at this game. And there's the shop right there for me. Kick a bomb yeah, over there. Bomb that guy. That's not gonna do it. Oh, it did do it. <laughs> the bomb radius is way, way bigger, or do you have a power-up? Uh, I don't have a power-up, no. Bomb uh, radius it's bigger in, in the in the classic game. I think it actually has a bigger a bigger radius for enemies, but a smaller radius for for blocks. It's oh green. come on! <laughs> it's not even <laughs> eternal greed, so this isn't even educational. <laughs> ah! will just kill you, and that'll be it. Yes, and you'll have learned to never try. I thought my kids. video was more entertaining this. Yes, I'm really sorry that I deleted it by accident. That is really quite embarrassing. Ooh, you can yes. reroll that. And oh, damn it. Now you got use for future money. Oh, this money right here. Make sure you keep away from the pit so you can pick it up. Oh Do you wait. Have any political opinions? Oh yes. I know. That, like, it's I, it's funny how politics uh, seems to just apply. Like, uh, American politics seems to apply to everything at this point in time. But um. When it comes to American politics, do you have uh, any any opinion on the current state of things? Oh, do I ever? Oh, do I ever? Yes, I, I, I believe firmly that she must be stopped at all costs, <laughs> Hillary. <laughs> and is Donald Trump going to stop her? Well, probably not, despite the fact that he's probably quite alright. And this, this latest tape, oh my god, is that retarded? Is that literally the best dirt you can dig up on this guy? Wow. What an embarrassment that people would actually consider this to be a, a a legitimate bad thing that he did. This this one thing that he said so long ago about being some kind of rich playboy. <laughs> the funny thing is, is that uh, this is by far the least worst thing he said. The like, least worst. <laughs> the least worst. Oh man, I'm of gonna all die. The things for people to get upset about. Um, and especially all the jokes that he's made. Um, this is this is by far the least upsetting. But yeah, Indeed. it seems to really get people upset. But uh, I don't know if you watched the uh, the debates, but they were pretty entertaining. It's it's really like a, oh. a reality show. Uh oh. I did not watch them. I probably should. Oh man, this is my last life. I'll just give you the 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 cliff cliff's notes. Uh. Basically, uh, they brought up that the controversy. And then he's like, oh yeah, well, I may have Fuck said those up. things, but your husband has raped women, and here they are, and then they're in the same <laughs> Oh, were they? Amazing. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're sitting uh, off camera, um, <laughs> and uh, it was really awkward. <laughs> <laughs> 
It's a reunion, uh, reuniting of of the of the rape. Yes, perfect. Yeah, they all and they also had um because I guess back forever ago um Hillary Clinton uh defended a rapist in court because she was a lawyer. Well, and, that's that uh, seems legit. Wow. And they they I believe they had the girl uh who was raped also there. Well. <laughs> It's but a fucking. It's it's uh. How how dare she do her job as a lawyer? Yes, we must put a stop to this. <laughs> yeah, but that Why Hillary? That, that was a thing. That was uh. a thing. But yeah, that's basically all it was. But it was um, it was super cringy. It was pretty pretty good. And here they are. Great. That that I I almost wish I had seen that. <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure it's around. You can oh see wow! It. Look at this. What a what a great thing to get. But why Hillary as a lawyer, though? It's why indeed. Couldn't he do any better, but yeah. <laughs> what what will I, I think, get? I think that, I think of that meat. she defended him, though, and the guy got off. That was the whole thing. Well, the that guy is good was then, accused, I guess. I think, of raping like a 13-year-old girl, and she convinced a jury that he was not... Wow. Well, I don't um, know. I'm half talking out of my ass because I don't actually care about any of this <laughs> stuff. Hmm. <laughs> Um, well, I, I care deeply because Donald Trump is really, he, he speaks to me as a, as a rich white guy, he, he really speaks to me. <laughs> this is, this is going to be the Florianism of the, uh, <laughs> oh my god, uh, the Florianism of the day will be, uh, will be uh, Donald Trump really speaks to me as a rich white guy. <laughs> I bet. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Well. I mean, the next, the next uh, what's that guy? The Oculus guy that like it turned out that he was a uh, a supporter of Trump and people like protested. I'm gonna have to like disassociate from you and be like, hey, just no. to be clear, folks, I'm I'm not a Trump supporter. I was I was gonna wonder about that because when we made Isaac, this was supposed to be the most offensive game we we would have made. But that, he didn't offend that, anyone. That would be allowed yeah, on no, Steam, no, I we guess. Failed. We, we, we failed horribly. Failed. Yeah. It's it's not offending. I mean, I I, f I succeed to a small degree where my eternal update offended a whole bunch of people on Reddit, but <laughs> other than that, <laughs> it was really quite quite a failure of offensiveness. What a mess up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, You're getting well. lucky on these uh, on these items here. Indeed. Well, I suppose. I wish I had more re-rolls. I wish I could just get batteries and then have re-rolls. I hope this isn't going to be too long for you, is it, Edmund? How much time have you planned? <laughs> uh, I'm going to probably cut it out after you die. Oh, I'll, well. Um, I'll go till you die. Secret. I'll, I'll it's never secret. die. I'll stick, I'll stick around for you to dig your uh, grave publicly. <laughs> oh. As you, as, you, as you explain to everybody how much you love Trump. Oh yes. It was indeed. So that's probably not even the, the most offensive political view I have, but, but I guess we'll just keep it at that for now. <laughs> so, so would you have any more? Oh, no. Don't you have people like I'm sure you say stuff on your other uh, your other let's plays that upset people? Don't don't people comment ever? Oh no, they. I'm I'm sure they're fine because I'm the guy who made that game where you that little. That little penis, and you shoot. Yeah, but I'm the guy that made that game too, and I get shit all over for saying just saying the word retard will will implode the internet. Really? Well, is, is is that a thing that happened? No, of course it is. What? When? What? I mean, what? You gotta tell me now. What? What is this? This it, retarded I, I, story. At some point in time, I said something was retarded, and I had I was attacked by a bunch of people on Twitter. God, it's always this one fly. <laughs> Can't use that word. And I said, wow. "Bofortian's retarded." Oh no! Like, <laughs> Remember like when Aaron okay. Hansen said that something was retarded, and he got a lot of flack for it? <laughs> Terrible. Hmm. And then there was some problem with the the recording. The audio got corrupted, so I had to cut some parts of of it out. Sorry about that. One time, these these people from India stole my game. Oh my Rip. god! What, what a horrible! Yeah, I'm just gonna keep. 
I'm just gonna keep playing until we run out of things to say, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have to oh, go. Oh, like that's gonna happen. <laughs> I, I, I gotta go soon, but uh, I, I, I will. I will finish up I, the 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 Indian people story. So that's right. There was this game that I I made called Bucket Ball. You probably remember it. Yeah, yeah, I do. And then oh, they yeah. they remade a game. Uh, they made a game that was called Circus Balls, and it was exactly my game. In fact, I'm I'm ninety percent certain it has my code in it, because it was. They, they were. How did you know that they were Indian? Uh, I talked to them. And it was just the worst. Oh my god. And just talking to him and then his voice, first over email and then his voice, it was just... It was just so much cancer that you wouldn't even believe. <laughs> Hello, Florian, How what can you lose your skin? You? How indeed. Uh, the red patch, right. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I, I, I burned it off, Edmund. In, uh, <laughs> in the new mode. Oh, yeah, I, I guess it is, because Samson's also different. Oh, wait. How are you? Hello, Florian, what can we do for you? So, oh, yes. Oh, wow, this item's really good on, on eternal mode. Oh, man, Edmund, if only we had the time. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do without me on here? Are you going to keep keep going? Oh, gonna... no, that, we couldn't do that. We'll just... Well, maybe I'll record the video and then I'll... And we'll comment over it next time if it's not terrible. Who knows? Well, yeah, why you never make it through this run? Oh, yes, but we're not... <laughs> Done will, yet. will Florian survive? Will Florian survive the uh, the tr the the Twitter tirade and the protest of everybody <laughs> ever owning this game ever? Yeah, that's Otherwise, right. We, we finally do... did it, Edmund. We finally offended everyone. Well, well, will Edmund have to uh, disassociate forever? <laughs> oh no, Edmund. With Florian Hemsel. Oh yeah, that's it's ah like... that. Oh, wow. so sniped. <laughs> Find out next time. Oh, well, we gotta, red now. We gotta explain more of this this Indian story, right? <laughs> All right, explain. <laughs> uh, so basically, Go the on. the levels they were more complicated than in my bucket ball because they were they have all kinds of terrain. But you can tell that the the engine isn't designed for for more terrain that the balls could bounce off because they would glitch weirdly through it just. Just how I had it originally, and that's why I only had very, very blunt and, and large shapes in my bucket ball. But yeah. then the way Dave did it, you could glitch through all the all kinds of things. And so the ripoff wasn't as good, which is I want to know how the hell you got their phone number and how you talked to them. I messaged them because how did I actually? I I don't know. I think I I found an email and then they added me on Skype. They wanted to buy me off for a hundred bucks. For a hundred dollars? I know, right? Wow. The, you can ask game, for more. I did ask for more, and then I, and oh, then yeah. they 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 threatened to sue me, so I just couldn't wow. take that cancer anymore. How ironic! How ironic! Yeah, they 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 thought I decompiled their their game to find out that my code was in it. Yeah, right. <laughs> they, they, they couldn't even figure out how to make balls spawn in the in the right place. They just. It just designed their level so that the balls would spawn where, where they were in my game, and then they would glitch through the walls <laughs> and then pop was out on, on the other that, side. Do you think, or was it like a small group of people? I think it was a team of three, and they hired a coder, and then the coder must have ripped them off by ripping me off, so... Uh, okay. I wonder how he found your code. Well, it was... It, it was fairly easy to decompile Flash games at the time. After that, I... I started making some kind of obfuscation on, on them, which I'm not sure was a smart move. It might have made things more laggy, but... And so I'm not just sure... just found your game and ripped off it? Yeah, they just opened up the source code and, and copied it, apparently. It was tragic how they... They had whole... There were whole programs where you could do that to, to Flash games. What assholes. Indeed. I do... Yeah, I remember... I remember those times. <laughs> oh, yes. Too bad that they... Well, two good thing actually is that they completely failed at making their money back on that game where they ripped me off, so that's uh -huh. cool. <laughs> or at least so they say, I I guess who knows. Oh man, another great item. Wow, this is really gonna be amazing to see what happens next on oh, yeah. the next video. <laughs> if any if any eternals get too close you can just blast them. Indeed. Oh Man is something Oh yeah, um Do you just 
isn't it weird that you see like ripped off games from po other popular games? Like people have made clones of Pokemon Go for God's sake. Oh yes, but they people, they are... there was actually there was actually um and we think it was do you remember the sushi castle thing? I do not actually think I've seen that. Uh, if you Google Sushi Castle, it's just a ripoff of the Binding of Isaac, and there's a high probability <laughs> that the code was just reused too. Oh no. man! I'm gonna, I'm gonna and they put it up right on uh, they put it on Xbox Live Indie Games back back in the day. Well, they surely wouldn't have ripped off my code very much very well if it's Flash and they put it on Xbox. I wish that. Yeah, was... but like some of the some of the stuff really did look like reskins. There was like a Duke of Flies and everything, and he even had I, I swear he even had the same cough sound. Oh, so Good it's idea. Just... This is just a binding of Isaac, but with a ninja. Uh, I don't even know what it was. It didn't even make any sense. I'm actually just watching the gameplay theme. right now. Uh, oh. This is generally an Asian theme. Yeah. It's gotta be ninjas, it's the only way. <laughs> uh, good old Gertie, that one's so much easier than the other one. Especially with this demon baby shooting. Anyways. non eternal bosses do seem a lot easier. Oh yeah. Harder, yes. Oh, non-eternal, right. So anyways, I'll, we should end Edmund. When I... I obviously re-watched these videos that we made on, on YouTube. Constantly. And that, yes, constantly. And then what happened is that YouTube would suggest to me all these interviews that you've done with other websites. <laughs> Do you ever have that where, where YouTube just suggests to you a multitude of, of videos that yes. you've been in? <laughs> not, not for me though, but the other day I was um, I was trying to find subtitles for this really really weird and obscure um, Japanese movie from the 70s mm -hmm. and I was trying to search on YouTube and just see if there happened to be one and the movie's weird and kind of sexual right and then the other day after searching that I went back when well, my friends were over and I was trying to show them a random video and then in my suggested videos it was like all this like softcore Asian pornography <laughs> <laughs> And I was trying to be like, wait, no. And I was like trying to defend myself from why that they're seeing this. And I'm like, come on, guys. Like, I'm not looking at porno <laughs> on YouTube. Like, if, yeah, I, if I'm looking at porno, it's I'm not looking for softcore porn on YouTube. Oh, man, you should do it, though. YouTube's got great softcore porn. I go there <laughs> regularly <laughs> for porn. <laughs> uh. You can look at things better on other websites. Oh yes, you can see all the clothes off, but what if you like clothes? What if, what if it's actually quite... Oh wow, he's really laid an egg for himself. <laughs> what if you like Check your nice clothes? Nice nice clothes that they wear? What, what if you think that more is le uh, less is more? Oh wait, no. <laughs> more is what if we got like a zipper hmm. on the trousers and then we just do that and we still got the clothes on? And yeah, we're still jack off. Hey, it can <laughs> be so sexy. <laughs> Even when clothes on. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh well, I should probably not keep you any longer. Well, I hope you're gonna be on for more videos, Edmund. It was f amazing as usual. <laughs> Hit me up next week. Hatred. There's a game called Hatred. It was quite yeah. shitty, but it and was actually kind of cool. And it was about a guy called Not Important, and he was <laughs> killing everyone because he, he hates humanity. Yep, that's it's what like, happened. It's like Florian. It's like Florian's dream. It was quite a nice game. It reminded me of po Postal. It was relatively short, though. Oh man, the White Heart, no. Well, now I might as well kill them. It was rather short, and the ending wasn't as amazing. Well, I guess it was kind of nice. Hmm. Well, he blew up the entire city, and he doesn't oh, no, care spoilers. if he dies along with him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. What a people game. Got, people got so mad at that that they had to remove it from Steam, and then Gabe Newell had to step in. Uh, I'm sure that was just one. One bastardly social justice warrior in, in the Steam ranks that, that surely has lost his job. <laughs> did they, they didn't pull it off Steam though, did they? They did, they and did, then uh, they brought it back. Slightly. And then we had to contact Gabe Newell. Indeed. <laughs> it was <laughs> very world, weird. What a world that I'm not really a part of and I don't look at anymore, so. I don't Offensive even know. Offensive games, yeah. We'll have to make an, a reappearance of, of the offensive games. We'll, we'll make Cunt 2. Let's we'll just go to go to Cunt 3. <laughs> you know what you should, no, you know what you should call it? You should call it Continue. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I was thinking we should make it Cunt 3D. It would be prop, <laughs> proper 3D glistening physics 
disgusting testicles. Uh. <laughs> oh well. Yes. I'm sorry for keeping you. Alright. Subscribe for more. Find out if I win. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. You, you can say goodbye to, as well to the people. <laughs> okay, I'll say bye. Bye! Bye!